We return once again to the world's largest consumer electronics exhibition, CES 2025. This is the fourth video on our channel dedicated to the main technological event of this winter. Held annually in Las Vegas, this event brings together leading companies, startups, and inventors from around the globe to showcase the latest advancements in technology. This year, CES served as the stage for premieres in fields such as artificial intelligence, robotics, smart homes, sustainable technologies, electric vehicles, and virtual reality. Among the main themes of the exhibition are the integration of artificial intelligence into everyday life, a mobility revolution, and devices that make the world more accessible and comfortable. CES 2025 is not just a place to demonstrate technology, it is a hub of global interaction where the brightest minds gather to discuss the future, find partners, and exchange ideas. We have collected for you the very best and most interesting innovations from the exhibition, ones that are poised to change the world. We would greatly appreciate it if you could support our efforts with a like and a subscription. Enjoy watching! No high-tech exhibition is complete without contributions from Chinese engineers, who have made remarkable advancements in robotics in recent years. At CES 2025, the Chinese company Fourier Intelligence presented its latest humanoid robot named the GR1. First introduced in the year 2023, the GR1 has become one of the most advanced humanoid robots developed in China. Its primary purpose is to assist in medical care, rehabilitation, and provide support for elderly individuals and people with disabilities. The robot stands approximately 1 meter 65 centimeters tall and weighs 55 kilograms, matching the dimensions of an adult human. It can move at a speed of up to 5 kilometers per hour, ascend and descend stairs, and carry loads weighing up to 50 kilograms. Equipped with artificial intelligence, the GR1 can recognize faces, speech, and objects, analyze its surroundings, and interact with people in real time. Thanks to advanced sensors and cameras, the robot navigates dynamic environments effectively and performs assigned tasks. The GR1 combines a compact design, high interactivity, and a focus on real-world needs and medical assistance, making it a significant step forward in the development of robotic humanoids. Species Corporation brought its revolutionary emotional robotic mannequin to the exhibition. This is not exactly a humanoid robot in the traditional sense of the term. The robot named Kosaka Kokona was first introduced in the year 2017. Kosaka demonstrates incredibly smooth and graceful movements thanks to 37 movable joints. The robot can be controlled remotely from a computer or tablet using the Miku Miku Dance software, allowing you to define and program its movements. The robot stands 1 meter 55 centimeters tall. Thanks to its beautiful, flexible movements, such robots add a kinetic dimension to the displayed clothing and accessories, something that was impossible with static mannequins. Moreover, since it is attached to a platform, Kokona can be easily transported and set up anywhere, and unlike autonomous robots, it does not pose a risk of falling and can safely be placed near people. The company Engineered Arts brought to the exhibition the already well-known robot surgeon named Alfred. At first glance, there is nothing unusual. A green blouse, a stethoscope around his neck, and this ageless man also enjoys making jokes about the Swiss. Moreover, he can recommend the best shawarma in town. However, Alfred is not just an ordinary doctor. He is an ultra-realistic robot of the next generation. The robot can engage in free conversations thanks to a new system augmented with artificial intelligence and voice recognition. It can answer any question, including those about his personal life, and he is capable of understanding almost all languages of the world, including accents. As the engineers of the company promise, in the long term, robots like Alfred could replace humans in fields such as tourism, and they would be perfect for roles such as hotel administrators. The engineers joke that so far, Dr. Alfred has not yet performed a single surgery. At the CES exhibition, NVIDIA showcased the capabilities of its new GeForce RTX 50 series graphics cards, but didn't stop there. The company also provided a platform for the humanoid robot Galbit G1, which utilized NVIDIA technologies to demonstrate its unique abilities. 
Galbit G1 is a robot standing at 1 meter 70 centimeters tall and weighing around 65 kilograms, designed to perform precise tasks and interact with its environment. During the demonstration, the robot smoothly approached a shelf filled with drinks and candies, using its sensors and cameras for spatial orientation. It carefully picked up the chosen treat with its manipulators and very slowly but steadily tossed it into the hand of a person standing opposite. Japanese developers from Kawasaki Heavy Industries also made their contribution and brought their advanced autonomous robot named Nyaki to the exhibition. This robot is capable of knocking on doors, opening them, and delivering drinks to hotel rooms. Currently, the robot can only open the doors it is aware of, but the developers are working on enabling the robot to open doors it sees for the first time. Another unique feature of the robot's design is its two arms, each with three fingers. This robot is expected to help address labor shortages due to Japan's declining population. The CES 2025 exhibition in Las Vegas also featured advanced robotic baristas. One of them was a robotic system from Stardust Intelligence, equipped with high-precision manipulators that amazed visitors with their coffee-making abilities. The robotic arms from Stardust Intelligence are capable of performing complex tasks that require high precision and speed. They have seven degrees of freedom and can move at high speeds of up to 10 meters per second. The robot can also recognize different types of coffee beans and automatically adjust brewing parameters to achieve the optimal taste. Additionally, the manipulators are equipped with tactile sensors, allowing them to handle fragile cups or glassware carefully. At the CES 2025 exhibition, it was impossible to walk past the humanoid robot T1 from Booster Robotics Company. This robot attracted visitors' attention with its amazing abilities. T1 demonstrated its flexibility and agility by performing various physical exercises, such as push-ups, dance movements, and kung fu moves. Standing 1 meter 20 centimeters tall and weighing 30 kilograms, T1 is equipped with high-tech sensors and a motion control system that allows it to move efficiently. It also showcased its ability to walk, bend, and kick a soccer ball, highlighting its capacity for precise and coordinated movements. Booster Robotics emphasizes that such a robot could become a full replacement for athletes, especially as its intelligence and analytical abilities continue to develop. The unique chess-playing robot Sense Robot Chess was presented at the CES 2025 exhibition. The robot stands out for its ability to adapt to the skill level of the player. The artificial intelligence analyzes the opponent's moves, adjusting the difficulty and providing helpful tips in real time. Sense Robot Chess offers several game modes, training, tournament, and an educational module. The robot can not only play a game with you but also analyze your mistakes, helping improve your tactics. The device supports remote games, allowing chess players to train and compete with other Sense Robot users around the world. In addition to chess, the bot is also skilled at playing checkers and backgammon. Although the price of Sense Robot Chess has not yet been announced, it promises to be accessible for both family use and professional players. The Japanese company NTT showcased its humanoid robot controlled by the next generation language model, Suzumi. This was not just a robot, but a demonstration of the advanced capabilities of generative artificial intelligence, which not only understands and processes commands, but also performs physical tasks, simulating physical sensations. During the demonstration at CES 2025, the humanoid robot operated by Tsuzumi performed various physical actions, such as moving objects, interacting with people, and reacting to physical stimuli. One of the robot's key features was its ability to sense its environment bringing it closer to mimicking human movements and decision-making. Write in the comments which of the robots shown in this video you liked the most. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. Also check out our previous videos. See you next time.